Your podcast is called Border Crossing, Essential Information Opportunities for International Businesses. Why are you doing a podcast and how do you want it to help business? So we, we've put together this podcast called Border Crossing, and it's a little bit of a play um, on, on what I do. I spend so much time abroad in a lot of different countries that I, I find myself crossing borders all over the place and coming up with information that is, is useful um, all over. Uh, it can go from the U.S. to the U.K., the U.K. to South Africa, wherever it is. Um, in this time where especially COVID has really, really advanced the the acceptance of, I think, doing business electronically uh, really, really was a seismic shift. I'm trying to find ways to project information without necessarily having to be somewhere physically present. It's a really powerful tool. And so what we're trying to do with this is really trying to, to find the things that we think people need to know from one jurisdiction or another and connect it succinctly with those people who need to know it. And so that's the, the real vision and goal here is just to, again, take that information people need to know and connect it with the people who need to know it. And so you see that in a lot of different ways, whether it's insolvency regimes, tax schemes, uh, different things going on in marketplaces or economies, just really trying to, to find an efficient way to project this information. So one of the goals of the border crossing podcasts are to try to take the information that's popping up around the world and connect it with people who need to know about it. Recently, one of those pieces of information in the insolvency world, which is going to be super useful for insolvency practitioners, attorneys, uh, hedge funds, litigation funds that, that chase people, is that in Cayman Islands, August 31st of 2022, a brand new restructuring regime came into place. Um, really interesting, uh, got a lot of value for domesticating foreign regimes into Cayman and potentially then uh, pulling those regimes through into the US or somewhere else via uh, chapter 15 or some other model law type structure. Got a, a great introductory podcast with a couple of friends from Cayman and a little bit more detailed one as well. So click through if you're interested.